Okay, I want to uh, show you a couple quick little warm-up exercises that you can use. I learned them in college when I was studying classical guitar at Butler University. And uh, I wanted to show you, one's just pretty simple, the other one is fairly simple once you get it down, and it's a great exercise for helping to keep your pinky engaged and ready to go on the fretboard. It would be a great exercise for the guys, that you, for those of you who, who only use three fingers. Um, so the first one, is just basically start on the F note on the first string and play F, F sharp, G, G sharp, and then back. So one, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. And on the right hand over here, if you want, you can practice your, you can do this on electric guitar, acoustic guitar, it doesn't really matter. Um, if you're going to uh, play, you know, with a pick, you can do that, that's totally fine. Uh, but on acoustic guitar, if you want to, you can do alternate your first and second finger. You can use your second and third. You can use your first and third. Uh, you can go one, two, three, uh, one, two, three, two, one, two, three, two. Uh, let's see if I can. Okay. But what I would do is I would go ahead and go maybe pick one of those patterns, just do index middle and go up the fretboard. And it may take you a while at first to get it down. And try to keep your fingers close to the fretboard. Don't push too hard. And you can work your way back down. Okay? You do it on the next string. And what you might do is if you're gonna do it on the next string, maybe use your index and middle finger if you're playing this on classical guitar. That way you can kind of spread the workout around to both hands, not just your left hand. Okay. You can even use all thumb. Um, so you can work your way all the way down, all six strings, all the way up, all the way back. And you notice I went all the way up till the ninth fret, till my pinky got to the twelfth fret. Okay. Now the other exercise is a little bit more complex. Follow me here. Index, pinky, third finger, pinky, second finger, pinky, third finger, pinky. So one, four, three, four, two, four, three, four, and then go up a fret and do it again. So fifty percent of the notes are your pinky. And 25% and of the notes are the third finger. So the third finger and the pinky are getting the most workout. And notice how it's forcing me to keep my pinky down. Okay, I might, on this one, I might be tempted to, you know, to be tuck my pinky away. And this, this was a great exercise for me because I did have that tendency to kind of tuck my pinky down like this. And then when I needed it, it took a second for it to come out and jump, you know, like a turtle head or something, jumping out of a shell. Um, so what what I would I would do is practice and on every string up the fret. Okay, and do it all the way down. Then next string, change your fingering over here. Index, you could go index ring finger. middle uh, ring middle and you'll be able to you'll feel it you'll start to feel it in the side of your hand as it is it um, as the pinky gets a good workout um, and you may not be able to do it quite as fast as that right away but you, sh you should be able to very quickly if you if you do it every day as a good warm-up Okay. Uh, God bless you guys. I hope this helps you. Bye-bye.